they got second very recently at a Xeno. Period. Um, period. Only losing to Sinji, um, I believe. Ooh. And regardless, just I mean, there's no question they're gonna be on PR this season. It seems like, and I think they're only gonna they're only gonna get better. I'm really excited to see what they do at Riptide. Really yeah. excited. Oh yeah. I, I, th I think so. I don't know. Anyway, oh. <laughs> I, thought, I thought they were saying that they were getting Riptide practice today, but maybe I'm wrong. I hope, regardless, I'm excited to see what they do at bigger events in the future. Um, but for sure, definitely love, we're actually gonna have Mario versus Duck Hunt, and I definitely kind of, you know, love the way that Mario kind of gets in sometimes. They are very stubby and very small, so sometimes it just doesn't really work out too well for them when they kind of just get outzoned by another character. But we could be seeing a different story here. However, you know, Irod is at 81% right now, 236 from Zane, and they've been playing the game. They have not really been doing too much. They've been letting Irod approach on them very aggressively. And yeah, Irod's really holding forward a lot, and that can be good. Oh wait, never mind. Ooh. Oh, I Ooh, think that, that could have been that could have been death right there. I think that was another up air into up B, but um. What, what do I know about it? Uh, Ooh, okay. Wait, hold on. That was a little key. I don't know. Yeah. And Zane, Zane has tricks for days. Zane oh, will, we've been new. I, I been watch new. Zane, and it's something new every set. He, they um, are really good at just mixing things up constantly. Um, and, and the thing that you actually wouldn't know about, you know, Duck Hunt is that they can, well, you obviously see it a lot of time after they're up they go into, like, they can use a move somewhere towards like the end of the but or I think just anywhere out of it however when you actually use the, like move like maybe let's say up air or just like you know nair you actually go into free fall after the move which is something that I didn't know that I learned recently and Ira despite kind of starting the stock taking like 80% now has a lead um, and this is the thing with Mario is you know Mario is really stubby but has insane airspeed in combo game. Like, you only need to get in a few times with that really good bear or nair, and that can lead to an extension, especially on triplats, that could be percent, large percents of death. So, like, um, this even now with, like, a 52% uh, deficit, it's not too rough. And, you know, I definitely love the way that Zing actually has been playing in neutral, and they kind of noticed that, like, that's kind of the thing that you have to do whenever you play against Mario. Like, you have to be very patient when they are trying to land, and also using a lot of their, you know, um, you know, kind of mix-up tools to kind of just catch a lot of the landings. And which is, it's really important because Mario is one of those characters where if you're under them the whole time, very nice up smash, by the way. When you're under them, they also, they kind of like tend to have very bad options. Is that gonna be death? Oh, wow. Mario on triplats is a different, it's a, it goes up a whole tier. It's really just a, a demon. I wonder Honestly. why Zane did not strike the stage. I, I mean, they personally really like. Um, they did shake build. their head a little bit, so maybe this wasn't the right stage to go. However, um, we could be seeing a little bit of a different game. I don't know. Yeah, Zane. I think the cans gonna be their best friend in these scenarios because it is a frame one option. It's gonna be one of your only ways to like get out of those Mario zero to death combos or ladder combos that kill you really early. And now Zane's at a percent that they can't get comboed like that anymore. And that Very F smash nice. gonna totally break through and a little bit of a fist pump from them. Um, a little bit of coughing is coming out. Period. I mean, they did start out a little bit rocky, but they kind of got into the hang of it. Um, I honestly feel like it was, they like definitely played really well. I think it might have been just a little bit that, of that disadvantage that kind of just like, you know, you might kind of get called out if you don't know what you're doing. And I mean, if you're like, I don't even know if it's just like a DI thing, but like sometimes Mario just like messes you up, especially if, you know, like you don't already know the matchup. Yeah, but Ma I mean, looks... Mario just mm -hmm. has one of the best combo games in the game, period. Mm -hmm. So, um, just, you have to be careful with that, but letting the... Uh, Irod go back to Battlefield. Zane must really like this stage to let Mario go to Triplats twice. I mean, it's not that bad of a stage for Duck Hunt, so this could be the reason for that. I mean, it's a really favorable stage for a lot of zoners, but it, it could be really favorable for a lot of people with um, a lot of combo potential. Ooh. Mario being one of them. That could have been Ooh. scary. Oh, I think um, I had a little bit scared of the can there, justifiably so. Mm -hmm. That is going to be 
just such an important factor for Duck Hunt. Without that frame one can option, it's gonna be really cool. It'd be so rough to deal with Mario's combo game. That's All right. Here. Mm -hmm. And trying to recover right here, trying to make sure that they catch Zayn on a lot of these options that they have so far. Not gonna get that S-Mash, but they're gonna both be resetting neutral right around here. And kill oh, no. They have an eye roll from Zane after that kill. Um, it's definitely a frustrating thing to um, get hit by, clipping the last hit of that dare. But this ledge trap could definitely result Back air? Period. in evening up the stocks. Look at that. Ooh. Okay, gonna reflect it and just playing a little bit, getting oh, no. a lot into, you know, Zane's face and, you know, still trying to be a little bit aggressive. Oh, this Ooh, could be not dropping it right there. Mm -hmm. But yes, that is not gonna do too much. However, we are seeing Zane in disadvantage right here and ooh. Yeah, I Zane. think they're a little they're struggling a little bit only because of the way that you know their can is positioned, so they kinda have to fight a little bit in that moment right there. Yeah, with Mario's airspeed, once Mario's in, it's gonna be hard for Duck Hunt to get back and set up that space that Duck Hunt likes to set up. Mario is just really good at staying on top of Duck Hunt. Um, especially when the can's already out somewhere else, you know that Duck Hunt can't escape with it. And so you can kind of press buttons a lot more freely. Ooh, and just missing that grab. Getting hit with that grab. Yeah. I think it's because they whiffed grab on the getup, oh, and yeah, yeah, that kind of just led to them getting reverse grabs, I guess. Because Duck Hunt does have a really good grab, so mm -hmm. it makes sense that Zane would try to space it really far, mm -hmm. but not hitting. But once again, evening it up right again, uh, right back again. And I think this is where Zane's starting to get a little bit more in tune with a lot of, you know, Irod's defensive options because. You know, they've been catching on to a lot of the rolls that they've been having and what just making sure that they combo? can't land. Yeah, and Zane doing a quick 88%, looking like Mario uh, himself. Oh, okay. no. No, 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 no. Ooh. That, taking I, that second that game. Is just, I, this is why I'm like, why why you, you cannot let Mario get Battlefield? You can't let Mario get Triflats. I don't know. And I feel like I think it was. I don't even think they. De I think they DI'd right, but yeah, it was I don't know literally if any just. I can save you in that spot. Yeah, like that was just looking like. That was just. Oof. Yeah, that they would have definitely been dead, as you can see from that top left corner right there, and they are going to Lila. Yeah, oh. I know. I know this is a stage that Zane really likes. So really, I, I think so. Oh, yeah. I, I think I've seen Zane counter pick Lila a few times, so I think they like the stage. Well, that's new. <laughs> I think maybe I'm wrong. I, I mean, regardless, they did choose to counter pick it here, and you do not have those tall platforms for Mario to potentially get those zero to death combos or really like low percent combos to death. Um, mm -hmm. And also, um, the tilts right there. If Duck Hunt could get in that kind of pocket. Um, Duck Hunt can position um, himself to like kind of be uh, kind of be really tough to get in because the, you have the platform protecting you and you have gunmen's covering the space above and can as well. That being said, a really dominating performance right here from Irod. Ooh, already at 111 percent. Zane is looking like they're struggling just a little bit, but getting that grab, putting them right back oh. off stage with 89%, almost getting that second can that could have been a really bad position, but sending them right back off stage. And, ooh. Oh, that was the gunman right there. Yeah, Zane, wow, that's really important to take that first stock, especially after getting like racked up to 100 really quickly. But Zane has been placing gunmen on ledge when Mario's recovering so well to where even if the gunman whiffs, Mario gets stuck in the hit lag of hitting it and Zane has much more time to set up a ledge trap. So really good stuff. Absolutely. And they could even probably get like a lot of more of a down air kill from situations like that. This game is so even right here. And a really good jump cape from Irod. Um, knowing the exact trajectory can's gonna be when you first uh, hit it out. Oh, Ooh, very nice Frame can. one can, coming in clutch. Ooh, hitting that can right away. Ooh. Okay. And this is where um, 
Lilat's really handy with these low platforms. It's hard for Mario to land on Duck Hunt. Um, Duck Hunt can cover the space under that platform super well. Ooh, Ooh, this, this is really be scary. Got to be very careful with those landings that you've been having there. Ooh, I like that. Back. Yeah, that was kind of just a little bit something to disrupt the tempo that Zane's kind of been having, but gonna get that S-Mash, and that's exactly what they've needed to keep their head in this game right here. Very F. nice. Oh, even getting that, that up air. Even that F-Smash right there, showing a bit of Lilac coming in clutch because Irat did not want to land on that platform where Zane was clicking can, so they landed on stage, and then the F-Smash covered that whole zone super well. Ooh, and just running Sneaky right recovery. over to the other stage, or side of the stage. Ooh, you gotta be careful. Yeah, and this is still scary because we saw how much damage Mario can rack up with platform combos, so... Ooh, this but... This is still Irod. Um, Irod can definitely still make a comeback right here. Absolutely, and that up smash was going to take it, rolled right into it. But Duck Hunt was still, you know, in the way, or in, you know, a little bit of, you know, Ooh. I guess lag. But now from... Irod on ledge, trying to jump over the can, going to get caught by that up air. Manages to get back to center stage, but at 107%, this is looking really scary. Okay. Oh, gonna get that down air. This could be where their advantage starts. Ooh, Ooh very nice. Clean grab. Yeah, using that can. Taking no chances, but now 165. Ooh. This is one Mario combo away. And to being in a kill, I think Irod was drifting back right there. Absolutely. That looked like an early kill. And that's going to be what takes the game. I mean, for sure. Um, so tense set. A very tense set right absolutely. there. Absolutely. Uh, so they took, or they used their jump, and then they got right back to ledge. But Zane did, you know, kind of cover a lot of options there. They did want to use jump, and I think they air dodged in the blast zone, and they kind of died for that. So that's just what ha happened. That's what I gave. And Zane takes that game 2-1. Period. Yeah. And yeah, I think that's gonna be it for us. At least for me, I know. I don't. Oh. Uh, both of us? I'm not sure. We don't know. Anyways, both of you. So, okay, both um, of us. 